your neighbor. This concerns your neighbor. And this is very serious. Shalom, the Lord bless you. Thank you for joining us. This is Papa San Marita Bliss with Pastor Honoring. Always a pleasure for me to sit, to come out here and share God's word or give God's prophetic direction to someone. I have a word for someone today. God says this concerns your neighbor and you should take it very seriously. And this word is coming to someone you have a neighbor that doesn't quite love you enough. They've proven in one or two occasions that they don't really, they are not fond of you. And you try to be nice because that's your nature. You are a Christian. You fear God. So you try to be nice to them. You try to get close to them. God says, not all your neighbors are your friends. That someone is living or working by you doesn't mean they are your friends. You owe them love, but you don't need to pull them close. You don't need to make them friends. Why is this coming as a prophetic word? Because someone is getting close to a neighbor who doesn't feel the same about them, who doesn't love them the way this person loves that neighbor. The neighbor doesn't love. The love is not reciprocal. And you getting close to this neighbor of yours. They are going to use your life against you. You're go they are going to use your information against you. And the enemy is looking for a channel through which to access you. And someone who doesn't love you but has access to you will be a good target to be used. Do not open your life up just because they are your neighbor doesn't mean they need to know what's happening in your life. They are going to use it against you. God says, be careful. God says, be careful. Smile when you see them, greet them and pass. You don't need to. The person I'm talking to, the spirit of God will bear witness with your spirit that this word is for you. You will have that inner confirmation that this word is for you. When you see this word, you will know it. I pray you get to see this. This word comes to you at the right time. God bless you. Shalom.